anti pigmentation sandalwood mask is a sandalwood mask but it is powder based because it is completely natural so i have uh, people who ask me how to apply it and i always tell them to take a consultation before applying this mask uh, people um, who have an oily skin i always tell them to mix the powder mask with 1 teaspoon of curd if they have in the house so they mix the powder and the mask uh, and the curd in equal proportion and then apply it on their face and people who have a very dry skin i apply i ask them to apply them with oil um sorry with milk so this mask one portion of powder and one portion of milk they beat them together and apply it on clean face by clean face i technically mean here that the skin should be exfoliated we should not apply any mask on a face that has already has uh, pollutants stuck in it like we have blackheads and whiteheads so there is a set protocol of following the masks even if you are not using an exfoliator i would advise them to use a gel meant for their skin whether it is the brightening gel or the papaya gel so that this gel works as a toner and an extractor of all the grime takes away the grime and at least makes the surface of the skin clean and then we can apply the mask also in botanic love uh, we do not have a a protocol of keeping the masks 100% dry all the time so once the mask is semi dry we usually dab some more water on the face massage it really nice emulsify it with the skin and then tissue it off and then we apply a serum on the face so this mask can be applied like that